Welcome to Blade HQ, everybody. Today is September 18th, 2023, and we are talking about some new knives. Let's get into this thing. First knife on the table is the new Petrified Fish Beluga Exclusive, featuring the 14C 28 inch Sandvik blade and the black micarta handle. And I have here on my notes that this is a three inch blade with a 6.8 inch overall, but now that I have it in my hand, I'm calling hacks. Let me grab my ruler. Let's see. For the blade, looks like we are at about three and a half inches. And then overall, maybe eight and a quarter. So yeah, three and a half inches, eight and a quarter. So definitely one of the larger of the everyday carry knives, not your three inch drop point. But I like it that way. I know that Dallas is the buyer here at Blade HQ for Petrified Fish, and he's got big old hands. Every time I shake his hand, I'm like, eh, I can get my hand around this meatball of a hand. But this is a knife that would fit in his hand very nicely, and I think that's one of the reasons he likes this knife so much. But that's, that 14C 28 end blade is one of my favorite steals because for its price, this knife is going for $48.95. You're getting extreme toughness, great edge retention, and a fine, fine grain structure. So if you've got the skills in sharpening, you will be able to get absolutely wicked sharp edges on this blade. And nothing in the, nothing in the world is quite as satisfying as cutting something with a knife that is that sharp. Don't think anybody will disagree with me on that subject. <laughs> Let me put my ruler away. Next up, we have new from Benchmade, two knives, both in the immunity series. We'll start with the full auto immunity. Gotta disengage the safety. All the Benchmade Black Class Autos will have that safety. And these are just so nice. These have been hotly anticipated. They were announced at Blade at SHOT Show 2022. And it's been a little, it's been a long time coming, but they're here and I'm so happy for it. What I love about these handles is you get those three fingers right there, and then this little little angle right here just grabs your pinky just enough so that you can get your four-finger grip. So you're getting a full grip, a nice CPM M4 blade. And just the perfect knife for everyday carry, in my opinion, because it's gonna be nice and light, nice and slim. Aluminum handles with steel liner is gonna give you great strength. The axis lock is super strong. M4 is very tough, has great edge retention. And look how tiny this thing is. You close it and you can vanish the whole thing inside your hand. Just a very easy to carry, well executed knife. And I love this reverse Tonto Warncliffe style they've got here, which gives you a very precise point so it can pierce just well as, you, as anything you want. But then you also have access to the point against a table or something very easy. Say on a drop point like this, which to be fair, this is my favorite blade shape. If you want to cut against a table, you have to pull your arm way up like this. Whereas on this, you're just pink right there. And then it also just glides through paper or packaging or whatever, like it's not even there. Very well done bench made. Now that one is an automatic. So if you live in a state like California or Oregon or Washington that has regulated automatics, you may be able to carry one with a shorter blade, specifically in California. I think Washington and o Washingtonians and Oregonians are unfortunately out of luck. I think these are just straight up illegal in your states. But if you're in California, I believe you can carry something under a two inch blade that's an automatic. And that's where the partial immunity comes in. Same blade profile, same materials, same everything, but you're getting a California legal blade. And even if you don't live in California, you might just want this one anyway, because you can get your finger really up nice and close to the tip for very precise cutting. So, Benchmade is always looking out for you. So whatever it is you are doing with your knife, if you are working, if you're working in a warehouse, I might honestly pick this one, because does that not remind you just a little bit of a box cutter, but this time it's not gonna have a chippy edge. You're gonna be able to resharpen it. You're not gonna have to replace it all the time. It's just gonna be a very nice thing for you. And it's an automatic too, so nice snappy action. Never made anybody upset. Anyway, those are the new immunities, the partial and the automatic immunity. Check those out now. They've been very anticipated for a long time. They might be gone by the time this goes out. And speaking of knives that are very anticipated, we have the HOM. This is the Chimera V2. And this one is like a Chimera. I'm not sure what all the updates are. I am not a super hardcore belly flipper, but this one's here. And those who have been asking for it are rejoicing because this thing's been very anticipated. It has this 
latch mechanism that is unlike any I've really dealt with outside of Homs, that a bunch of different ones have it. But the latch is sort of a controversial thing with the, with the ballet flippers because it allows you to carry it in your pocket, it's convenient, it locks the blade open so you can hold it by one handle and it's not gonna drop. But when you're actually flipping and doing your crazy tricks, sometimes that latch gets in the way. So a lot of people just pull it off and then carry it in a sleeve or something. But Hom has you covered because this latch will just stow right inside the handle like that. So now you can do all your flips with easy control. Not gonna have any problems at all. And that latch is gonna stay there. When you're ready to put it away, pull that latch out, latch the knife, and it is safe to put in your pocket and you're not gonna cut yourself pulling it out. Very nicely done Hom design. And these ones start at 419 and go up from there. They have an S35 VN blade, titanium handles with different layer, with different inlays and backspacers. Just excellent butterfly knives. These tend to go very quickly though. So if you see this and you want one, I would recommend acting quickly. And last on the table, we have one that we've shown a few times on a few different videos. It's the Gerber strong arm with the new materials and everything. And I thought now is a good time to just tell you what the deal with this knife is. Before the Gerber strong arm was available with a black handle and a black blade or a like a coyote tan OD, not D, OD, FDE handle and a black blade. This time we have this OD green handle and a stone washed blade and these are new. You can only get them at Blade HQ for the year 2023. After that, they are available in the rest of the world. But if you want one now or for this holiday season coming up, Blade HQ is the only place you can get these. They come with a nice black sheath and like the strong arm has in classic fashion is so many different ways to mount this thing. Very nicely done, Gerber. And I will say, I was going to say this is the first stonewashed bladed strong arm you could get, but that is not true. They did a BDZ-1 sprint run a while ago, and that one had a gray handle and a stonewashed BDZ-1 end blade. But I personally, even if they still made that one, might go for the 420 one. Having done a little bit of research on this steel, it really is a good steel, I think, for this application. Its stainlessness is off the charts. You're not gonna rust this thing. Its toughness is off the charts. It's tougher than CPM-3V. It's almost as stainless as H1, and yeah, its edge retention leaves something to be desired, but it would not be difficult at all to get an edge right back on it. So I think for a field knife, or somebody who, where they say ounces are pain, that ounces are pounds, pounds are pain, is that, is that the line? The backpackers will all use that line. If you're in the military, if you don't have to carry a sharpening stone and you can just pick up a rock, a smooth rock, spit on it and get an edge back on here, that's a stone you don't have to carry around, just saying. <laughs> You could do a whole lot worse than that 420 steel. Anyway, these are going for $89.95. Get them at Blade HQ through the end of the year. Thank you all for joining us today. We hope you found something you like, and we'll see you next time.